Hello and welcome back to another Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. I'm playing as Kaiserin Trude Ironside. Kaiserin, Kaiserin is like Emperor, Empress. Uh, I've never heard of Kaiserin before. She became Empress, but that's the title for Germania. So of the Empire is Germania. It is the year 1125. We just took the last remnants of Bavaria, which uh, became Austria for a little part. And we've taken it. It's now ours. Made this guy the Duke of Austria. So, 1,100 heavy horse. Well, we want more. I want heavy cavalry. I want 2,000 in total. It's going to be a while to save up. So now my uh, my goal, immediate goal, is is he still is Lombardy still at war? Oh, oh yeah. yeah, they're still at war. They're holy war with here. Their armies are going to be really busy. If they try to confront me, they're going to get destroyed. I don't really fancy the idea of stopping a holy war against Muslims down here. I want this to all become Catholic. That's another goal I, I should have, an ultimate goal. I don't know if it's going to happen in this game, though, because to me, what's more pressing is not these guys. And anyways, the Aztecs could very well land here anyways, so we'll have to see. Uh, my goal, like I said, I want to take France. I want a little bit of territory to here out of Lithuania. I, w I definitely want to convert the Germanics in Scandinavia and uh, the Removas in Lithuania. I want to get rid of those two pagan pagan um, religions. But definitely the Germanics have been a thorn in my side. They're a thorn on everybody's side. They're just pain in the ass. All that constant raiding. Here they are raiding. It's, they're just an, they're just bastards. So what I'm going to do after I take Nukatel from Lombardy, I'm going to go and hit, take this place as a de jure war. And then after that I'm going to start focusing on these guys and uh, Lithuania. We're going to bitch slap both of them get them take them down bit by bit until they're i don't want all their territories i don't want this to be all germania i want this to be a uh, catholic so you cannot in this game you can't force people to become catholic by victory i think you used to be able to do that in Crus or sorry uh e3 you can't do that in this game you can force them to convert okay so let's get the retinue over where is this um is it argo what is this place? Argyle, yeah. Never been a shortage of troops. Good. Whose army is that? Burgundy. I can also call England into the war. Claim Dijon. Now that's come back. Okay, I'd rather take Dijon, which is right here. Duke of Champagne. Fine. He's sh that's mine. Okay, so we'll go after Nukatel at another time. That will pretty much round away the, the Lombardian territories here. I don't know about going here. This I can also take. These are de jure. If they're part of a Bavaria, I don't see why I can't in the future, but it's nothing pressing. I wish that Lombardy... I don't know. I don't know what I wish for them. This is kind of weird the way they are. I, I wish it, if they weren't going into France, I wouldn't really care about them. I'd support them all the way, but they're going into territories that I want. And they're also a rival. They did take Corsica for me, so... Yeah, let's get everybody up. Everybody. Uh, Anjou will not accept. But we'll get these guys up. England, I know, is already in a war. Call the arms. But I think they're about to win. They're at 73%. There's no Scottish army. So they can come down and help if, if they can. When they can. Let's get everybody. My kingdom is so vast. Let's just go in Dijon. That's not even connected to their territory, so they'll have to. We'll see their armies coming. Well, they have seemed to. Bless your house. Of course. Okay, he's coming to war. They seem to have raised up force here. I'm not sure. Is Bur Burgundy at war with them? No. Why is there an army down there? Strange. How about technology? Anything new? Anything even close? Whoa. 1.288. Not bad. 1.988. That's the highest I've ever seen. And then here's 1.96. What's their education? Their learning is at 10. Plus, it's it's also developed... Learning is for all the uh, technologies, but it's split. Like, this will be your stewardship plus learning, and this will be your uh, martial plus learning, and this will be... What the heck is cultural? I think it, is it just learning? Learning plus diplomacy. Okay, gotcha. Oh, we can take up Tolerance. It's the last one. It gives us less uh, penalty for different culture, different religion. So there was a technology after all. My income is still in the green. 
good. All of these freaking armies, there's so much of it. I didn't even look to see what we're going to get. Wow, 30k, not bad. Just from the vassals and 6,500 almost from my own levies and then there's be over 3,000 from my retinue. Where is the retinue, by the way? It's slowly coming over. Yeah, I also forgot about that. I don't want to put 30,000 in there. Or 35,000. It's 22k. I'm not sure what the heck to... I don't know. I can't be so... anal about the numbers here, even though I'd like to put it all together and split it in half. My liege, I believe that when your vassals can be discouraged... Wow, there's a lot of... all the options. Threaten, obligate, blackmail. Bavaria. So we'll black go with blackmail. This guy has 29%, so once he's out of the way... Okay, I think... Okay, so he's agreed. I think this guy needs to go now. County of Everu. Sure, we'll... Oh, I was reading it wrong. Okay. Uh, yeah. No more. No more, no more, no more. Everybody go here. In fact, we can use a little bit out of here. Is this my retinue? I think it is. No, it's not. It's 3,000 guys, though. Just get it out. Oops. Not this big army. Get out. Stay there. Merge. Get out, get out, get out. I don't want to suffer attrition, please. Not with the retinue. July 4th save. So yeah, this is not quite split. There's going to be more here in Dijon. But I should have around 15,000 here. And, um, <laughs> Bourgogne. <laughs> Looks, it's spelt Bourgogne. <laughs> I didn't lose any for attrition. So, but it's uh, pronounced Bourgogne, I, I believe. Thanks to a commenter. The only regular commenter, and of course I forget your name. Anyways, I do appreciate you. Um, <laughs> you know who you are. <laughs> And don't say that I, uh, don't think that I don't appreciate your comments. I do like it when people watch my videos, not just, uh, come and watch a few and then make a comment and never come back. Regular watchers are cool, and if you're here for my Paradox games, I'm always gonna have Paradox games, as long as I'm making videos, because I, I just love strategy so much. I want EU4, I'm not gonna have two running at the same time, because it's, they'll just be, uh, I mean, I could, but I'm, I'm too, I'm too, uh, I'm drowning in all the videos I have going right now, so I, I would love to have EU4 and Hearts of Iron 4 both going at the same time. I just don't... That would just break me. I, I couldn't do it. Okay, so select Marshall. We need a new Marshall, 15. So I'll stick with this game and EU4. Train troops. Yeah, our Marshals are just not that great. So our leadership is not that great. It's just average. 13 is about the highest I'm going to get. Age 20, Heike, my daughter died. Did, But she was married for four years. They didn't have any kids. Well, maybe it's a good thing she didn't become the new Kaiser, and I don't know what this guy's going to do. <laughs> Poor dude. Leading troops in Bourgogne, but is he going to stay? Where? I don't know what's going to happen to him. Because he's got no ties to me, no children. Uh, chaplain, excuse me, heresy. There's one time where it was correct. Uh, court is not heretic. Let me see what happened to that guy. He's easy to see. He's got that tonsure type haircut. I don't know if he is. I can go look at my daughter. I don't know if he's going to stay. He's still leading troops in Bourgogne. Okay. Why did I marry? Oh, because he's got good traits. He's strong. Very good traits all around. Uh, well, if I had another daughter. Maybe I could give him territory, actually. Um, I can't. Invite to court. He won't. 85. I'm not sure what I could do with him. Arrange marriage. Arrange betrothal. though. See, I don't want to give up Poland and the Byzantines, though, for him. I need another daughter. Educate child, arrange betrothal, arrange marriage. Maybe I could marry him to this woman in my court. 
Ingletrude, she's 21, he's 21. Cathilda asks, since we all die anyways, why be so hassle about life? Uh, okay. I suppose you are right. 50 for chase, 50 for temperate. Cathilda did not seem to, take to like physical contact. She's chased. I actually hate that. I don't... <laughs> It just kind of grinds me <laughs> against me because I like the pleasures in life. I'm not a hedonist, but I like to have things in life. Um, the hell do I do? Playing games is most my biggest vice, I guess. Yeah, but I like physical contact. I like I like women. I like to have sex with women. So like, the idea of being not wanting that is just so against my core values. I don't even. I can't even imagine that. Ew! Don't touch me. I don't like to be touched. Like what the hell? <laughs> it's strange. I, th I think you have issues if you don't like to be touched. Uh, yeah, there's no army. I, I didn't think that they would. They're down here. I can tell that they've taken... They're sieging here, Saracusta. Um, I th think that if they're still doing that... I wish I could get eyes down there. Because I'm actually... I'm hoping that they win. In a way. I do. You know what? I might as well do something with this army. I don't know why I think of it before. Let's just go and get our war score up better. This is going to take a while. This is such a big kingdom we're fighting against. Uh, Seeds fabricate a claim. Get out of here. The woman accused of witchcraft in Stettin has been dragged before your court. Several witnesses have seen her performing dark rituals in her secluded hut, possibly related to recent crop failures. She claims in excuse me, innocence, and it falls on me to determine her fate. She will burn at the stake. <laughs> wow. Uh, local revolt risk minus 5%. It's not bad. This says that the people feel protected. Throw the fiend in the dungeons. Uh, what nonsense is this? Release the poor woman at once. Uh, I gained 50 cultural technology points. Local tax modifier. Plus 10 peasant unrest? Just for Stettin. That's fine. I'll take the 50 cultural points. Really, I mean, I don't... They're just being idiots anyways. Let's see. This guy's being dealt with, is he not? I th think so, yeah. Evru. Religion, 100%, not bad. Let's go to my technology. So 99... T why, is the, why is this going so slow? I hope my, my mouse is not dying. Yeah, this is going slow. Not moving around the map that fast. Um, Evru has been success. Okay, so what's this? So shipbuilding and then heavy infantry. Okay, heavy infantry, then light infantry, then shipbuilding. We're still waiting on that. I'm just irritated that the mouse is not moving. The cursor's not moving around fast. Oh, the mouse is moving fine because the cursor is dying. How much left of this video? I might have to fix this. I think yeah, it's going a bit better now. I think we can look, live to the end of the video. So, who's that? Troy's. Middle Frankia, that's, yeah, that's my Viceroy. He has the Middle Frankian symbol. Is this where he is? Yeah. Acting King. I don't know who he's at war with. Click on him. He's in a few wars. Claim on Dijon. Is he also? Oh, he's, that's my war. Uh, he's also in the war against Scotland, but he has his own war against, uh, did your war over Nevers? Is that here? Surely, yeah, he's attacking, uh, Burgundy, probably to take that. So he's doing the work that I would have wanted to do anyways, so it's okay. He's gonna win, obviously. He's got a fair size army, around 13,000. when my children can be educated. January 4th. It's my daughter, Princess Hildeberg. She's age 6. Betrothed to the Byzantine Empire Prince. So he's 2. It's going to be a while. I'll educate her. I probably should educate my son, especially with all the awesome traits I have. I have nothing but stress. That's the only negative one. And that's, as far as I know, that doesn't get passed on. Leave one of your vassals can be discouraged from associating blackmail. Good. Good old uh, Prince Enoch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We just suffered like 5,000 attrition here. Nukatel. 12.5k. Well, we'll lose another 600. 
that blows. That actually both blows. Mankind is unlevel. No more charity. Ah, lose charity. Church opinion plus ten. Same trade opinion plus ten. Three diplomacy. But she's still okay. Sixteen. Picking ambition. Amass wealth. That's odd. Okay, so I think all the factions are gone. Good. Haven't been able to do this much lately, but let's go and study technology. Let's go to Rome. And what can you do? Well, he can fabricate a claim, but I don't... I don't really care to use that right now. He can go and, like, sow descent. I don't even know where to use that. Uh, could go to Lithuania. I just don't want to lose him. No, I don't, I don't know. I don't want to lose him. Such a good spy master. Okay, the war with Scotland's basically over. Yeah. Oh, it wasn't over this spot. Okay. I'm not sure what it was over. I think, was it over this island? I'm not sure. Maybe it was over this Clydesdale. Well, we are at 20% against them. Oh, why still? Why is it still suffering attrition? Drop down to 10. Let's just split. Oops. No, no, no. I, for God's sakes, I want you to stay. Just one of you go. Quite a lot of uh, holdings here in Dijon. Another new faction has popped up. So we can't get rid of them. Honorary title, Keeper of the Swans. Where's the gift? Uh, obviously he wants too much. 140. Where are you? No army sighted from them. So a couple small things here. Hope they're winning. Well, this is no longer under siege, so I don't know. Maybe they're chasing around one of their armies. There's also two civil wars going on here. If you look at this, uh, Sturian Liberation Revolt, and then uh, Civil War to Lower Crown Authority. As I woke up this morning, my hands and feet were bleeding, and there was a sharp pain in my side. What's happening to me? <laughs> I think, isn't she already zealous? I don't see it. Is a stigmata and blessed by God. Ten piety. No, she was not zealous before. So, Marshall plus two. Church opinion plus ten. Monthly piety. Oh, yeah, my retinue's here. I take it that they took a lot of casualties then. Jeez, that's probably why I'm not getting that much money. July 4th, save. Someone's in Goddingen. Should send up this guy. Who is up there? Teeny little army. Yeah, what happened to my retinue? I almost don't want to look at it. Well, they've lost... Not tons, but... Waiting for this. 158. Oh, there's Lombardy. Tiny army. England's over there helping me. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so. Yeah, I said they're no longer there sieging. What happened to them? Well, I think that they're, mo they're moving about 10,000 guys up here to confront the English. Uh, we're at 46%. Okay, we already just took a place. I think that I should move this army over there. This is my husband's here at 12, 13. Uh, I don't know, Wilhelm. Brilliant strategist. He's an organizer, so he moves faster. Auto, 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 auto. I don't even see auto. He's at 10. We could have better leadership. Okay, so he's already there. He's nothing. And let's put in hands. 
hands. He's got no, no military traits. That's a bit better. Let's see how this battle goes. I would prefer to have all my heavy cavalry in there too. Maybe I should move this. What's the amount of attrition? It is August, so it's middle of summer. Supply 12k. No, let's leave them there. I hope I'm not making a big mistake. What's the supply here? 32k, we're fine. They're moving. So, are they going to catch them? August 24th, August 25th. Yes, they're going to catch them. So we'll continue on the way we're going. Where'd they go? They joined up with me. What does this look like? Well, it looks like we're going to be crossing a river. 150 of the heavy cavalry that don't have that much. We definitely outnumber them. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. I think we could still do it. We don't have the punch of our heavy cavalry, though. Should still be able to beat them. Their leadership is quite a bit better. God engine. I have a feeling we're going to come out of this war with a lot fewer soldiers. Win or lose. We still do have, well, started with about 350 heavy cavalry. Rather heated discussion between myself and the stable master caught Princess Melissa's attention and after listening to us both. Yeah, she was my half-sister. I married her to a prince in Poland. Is it? Uh, I don't think, he's a duke, so he, there will be, obviously, she's my half-sister. I don't think that there'll be any alliance that way. Anyways, he's just a duke. So they're putting a little bit more soldiers. We are winning. Okay. I, I don't get the... It's paused up here anymore. I'm used to playing EU4. I have to keep looking up there. Okay, so you're going to Forez, where we just came from. Now you can go here. Take the last county or two. Their army is virtually destroyed. We'll have it sit in Bourgogne after this, just to reinforce either side. Or I can leave it here. What's... 22k, that should be fine. We'll just leave it right here. 71%, uh, that's fine. And I guess I'll end the video here, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you again.